Hello, people. Another beautiful day. Yeah. <laughs> Hope your five senses work. Health and strength is good. Or excellent. What? What's up, Steam Deck fans? Steam Deck tribe. Steam Deck nation. Steam Deck universe. Steam Deck world. Steam Deck legion. What's good? Steam Deck mob. What's happening? Steam Deck squad. What's up? <laughs> yeah. You Steam Deck fans are getting spoiled. And you Steam Deck nerds, geeks, and freaks. What's happening? It's in your flavor with y'all. Alright, what I got for you? So now, hmm, Baldur's Gate 3, huh? Playable on the Steam Deck? Don't worry, it'll be verified soon. Says here, uh, Valve says Baldur's Gate 3, playable on Steam Deck. It falls short of verified status due to its use of a, a launcher and non-Steam Deck controller icons as well. As text input require manual invocation of the on-screen keyboard. So yeah, Baldur's Gate 3 on the Steam Deck. That's the goal with the 10,023 games that you have. Yeah, you little Steam Deck fans always getting spoiled. Now, let's talk about this little summer sale. Summer sale you guys got for the Steam uh, for the Steam Deck. Do you got your? Do you have your nickels, your pennies, nickels, dimes, quarters, five dollar and one dollar bills ready? <laughs> Listen to this. Steam Summer Sales uh, 2023 is live with the Steam Deck up to 20% off. Mm. Says today's this Steam Summer Sale is live once again where a great many developers put up big discount for their games. You know the drill, right? Your wallet is always hiding from you. <laughs> Gaming on Linux funny. He says not only are lots and lots of games on sale, but the Steam Deck is as well. You can pick up the 64 gig model with 10% off, the, the 256 gig model 15% off, and the 512 gig model 20% off right now. Interestingly, the two lower models have been out of stock in the UK for a while. Well, yeah, Valve, you need to re you, you need to restock your shelves anyway <laughs> for a while, but now they are back in stock. <laughs> I wonder if Valve were hoarding a bunch of <laughs> gaming on Linux said this. I wonder if Valve were hoarding a bunch of ready for sale, expecting many to get sold at once. <laughs> says here, uh, Valve also put up a special top 100 page for the Steam Deck, so you can easily scroll down through a nice list with discount and expect compatibility with Deck Verified rating. You can also get the Steam Deck on sale. On Komodo for sele select regions, and says here always if you find particularly good deals for a game that works on Linux or the Steam Deck, be sure to comment or give your own recommendation. I am currently going over my own wish list, but my pile of <laughs> he said, but my pile of shame is already rather long at this point. <laughs> anyway, says uh, for a few quick picks, I recommend Valheim. 40% off, highest discount yet. I also will never not recommend Deep Rock Galactic 60% off, both great co-op games. Not that Dead by Daylight 60% off works great. I can also get, I can also suggest that as well as great fun. Says your Valve has a few little treats with a free sticker to claim each day. A new seasonal badge in Point Shops 2 artist profile and some chances to earn summer's sale trading cards to level up your summer sale badge <laughs> yeah you see you steam deck fans uh are getting spoiled it says here check out the sale on steam page the summer sale lasts until july 13th so right now is the 29th you got you got another, uh, you got another, what, fifth, 14 days. Yeah. Get shopping. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, what else? Now, got this other article here, too. He says, uh, there's a, there's a sharp, charge disc. Could be useful for Steam Deck st storage, uh, sidekick. He, he, he said, uh, I am currently, I am currently keeping an eye on the charge disc. A really small M.2 NVMe. SSD enclosure that plugs directly into the Steam Deck and it says and many other devices mentioned briefly but in my recent new roundup this device looked like it could be really useful 
since there are many different type of SSD enclosures it's not a new idea but it does look good the compact size portability plus the cooling fan and drop proof case all adds up to a device that I feel like I need to carry around it says charge uh, disk is an ultra light weight and small portable M.2 NVMe SSD with active heat, heat dissipate dissipation system with two terabyte maximum capacity and high read slash write speeds of a hundred of a thousand megabytes features an aluminum shell and a silicone case for any unpredictable circumstance charge this is the perfect choice for those who often carry EDC device such as phones cameras laptops currently it's being funded via Kickstarter with around 327 682 in pledge it says here from 3603 back, uh, backers so there's a fair bit of interest in this little device their trailer even show it with a steam deck <laughs> yeah it says the full kit with the drop proof case and warp wrap around cable costs around 42 but just the enclosure will be about 32 seems like quite a reasonable price check it out on kickstarter hmm. yeah you steam deck fans are always what getting uh spoiled <laughs> you and your deals you and your games and your updates <laughs> yeah you guys are good man um you got your summer sale lasting until the 13th of july get shopping then you have Baldur's Gate 3 to deal with, along with your 10,000 and um, 23 games to play. Yeah, now you got a charge a charge uh, disc now. Hmm. Co connects right into your uh, Steam Deck. It's a M.2 NVMe, M NVMe SSD enclosure. Hmm. Up to 2 terabytes, huh? Hmm. Yeah. You Steam Deck fans, man. You and your deals, games, and updates. So, yeah. Get get busy shopping, you know. Uh, a lot of games to pick from. A lot of good deals. Got a deal on the um, 64, 64 gig model, two fifty six, five twelve. Yeah, <laughs> Europe Europe was out of stock, but now they're back. <laughs> but that mean that means Valve was hoarding some of the Steam decks. <laughs> yeah. So yeah. Um, have fun, man. Um, this is just this what summer right now, and today's the 29th. Another what's that? 62 plus eight plus no plus seven. Another 60, 67 days and what? Uh, uh, Starfield is here. Oh yeah. You know, you know Valve, you know Valve, AMD, uh, Bethesda, and Microsoft is working on. You know, they're communicating and t trying to test test it out to make sure it runs on the Steam Deck. But give it time, it'll show up. <laughs> give it time, they're working. So yeah, you know, AMD, AMD, um, they saw an opportunity in a, uh, with uh, Starfield, <laughs> and I guess they were like, okay, why are we sitting? Like, why are we sitting back? Missing out on the biggest game of the year. We need to jump at this. And they did. Yeah. <clears throat> so now you can use, if you got an AMD graphics card, one of the latest to go with to go with Starfield. Oh yeah. They they, they had to do that, you know? They had to do that. So Yeah, when you see we when you see when you see an opportunity, you know, you gotta um you gotta seize it. Yeah, you gotta seize it, you know. So yeah. Good move good move on AMD's part. And they're working on FSR 3, yeah. And you know the Steam Deck is still is getting updates, <laughs> and of course, <laughs> and of course the uh, the Vulcan Tribunal, you know, <laughs> they're gonna issue issue a DMC uh, DMC uh, takedown <laughs> of the word Vulcan. <laughs> so yeah, be on the lookout for that. But uh, yeah, you guys are good when it comes to. Uh, 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 gaming on the Steam Deck, you know, uh, this this thing been all, all, it's all it's going on, it's go, it's all, it's all it's coming up on the second year, 
and it's doing pretty well. They're doing pretty, doing really, really well. So yeah, um, Valve, uh, uh, they, they nailed it. <laughs> they came out. They said we couldn't find a game. <laughs> The Steam Deck couldn't run and send a message to the video game industry like uh, we're here to play. <laughs> so yeah, and they're they're doing pretty well. Man. So yeah, but I'll keep you guys posted on what's going on with the Steam Deck. Anyway, leave this video for y'all to enjoy. Nice talking to you people again, Chris. Still Star Wars, Star Trek, or Dark Side. Go, peace.